friendly PSA to pay yourself first. Any deposit that you get, direct deposit or birthday money you get, pay yourself first. 10%, 15%, 20%, 30%. Pay yourself first and then deal with all the other expenses of life. You know what I'm saying? Even a bigger pro tip. My, my suggestion would be stop using your credit card until you have at least $1,000, maybe even $3,000 saved up in your savings account so that you can build the financial muscle of saving before spending. But no long talk, let's cut straight to the video. Tyrant cops and uh, yeah, I, got, yeah, yeah I, I ain't gonna say too much about them, you know? Y'all, you know the deal. If something suspicious like that is going on, we mm. want to stop and check out. And, sure. You know, this is totally respect that. unusual behavior, right? And I don't know about that, but I get it. I don't have to identify myself. It's my first amendment to film public officials right. doing what they do. Well, we'll see what the, uh, what the sergeant sure. has to say here when he gets here. What law do you suspect me of breaking? Are you looking to create a problem here for us? Welcome back, everybody. Just a simple video today to share some exposure to a new auditor. This is Rowdy Podcast, and he's been on the platform for less than a month. He's got a podcast on Spotify, and so far, only a couple videos on YouTube. Currently at only 61 subscribers, but I like what I'm seeing. He's calm, knowledgeable, and respectful. Both of the clips that I'm premiering in this video were uploaded just a couple of days ago. Hopefully, we'll see a lot more of this guy. If you like what you see here, head on over there and show him some love. Let him know that I sent you. Links are in the description below. Hello. What's going on? Not much, just walking around. Videotaping the police department's not a good idea. Why? You guys are friendly people. We are, but why are we doing this? Why wouldn't we? Because it's a security issue for us. Is it? It is. I don't think so. It is. It's public property. It is public property, but when you start recording our perimeter and our gates and what our activities are, it's a, it's a concern to us. I've only been here for about 15 minutes. Right. We had officers that drove by and saw you pulling out of here, walking out of here, and said that you were recording them as they left. I did. Yeah, and that's an issue. Why are we doing that? I don't have to have a reason. You don't have a reason. I don't have to have one. Okay. Do you have a driver's license? I can see. I don't. What is your name? I'm not going to give that to you. You're not going to give it to me? No. Why would I give it to you? I haven't done anything wrong. Well, you're recording our property. You're recording okay. our building. Sure. And it's a security issue for us. Am I being detained? You are. Okay. Until I can get you identified. And what's your who reasonable, you are. I want to make sure that you're not suspicion. doing something that's a problem for our law enforcement community. So in order to detain somebody, you have to have a law that you're investigating, correct? So what law are you? What, what law do you suspect me of breaking? Are you looking to create a problem here? <laughs> Every time, bro, every time I see someone ask this question, they don't really answer the question. What law do you, suspect, do you suspect me of committing? Or do you suspect me of, of uh, breaking? And they never answer the question. It's like, they just try and brush it off. Are you, are you looking to cause problems here today? Every time, bro. Every time. I'm like, bruh. I get it. That, you know, in some cases, but you are a public official, public property. You, We are allowed to record you, public servant. You know, like, oh my days. Oh my days. Oh my days. These videos just really opened my eyes to the reality. Imagine all the atrocities, all the shit that's going on four cameras shout out to uh, Samsung shout out to Hawaii shout out to Apple y'all done change the whole game bro y'all done change the whole game course, no not at all I'm being polite and cordial I'm, I'm being polite and cordial too so I'm asking you for being a little difficult. so we can identify you I don't need to and be on our way why would I need to identify myself because I'm asking you to identify yourself what's your name and badge number my name is Todd Hines my badge number is 200 okay your name and badge we're recording you just like you're recording yeah. Yeah, okay good so okay well I mean I'd like to be on my way to go I mean, you have to so have are reasonable... you refusing to identify yourself? Well, there's no need to. 3916, are you a supervisor? I'm not. Okay. You just called for a supervisor? I did. Very good. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, you bet. I'm not, I don't have any ill will. I'm not here to hurt anybody. Yeah, I'm not armed. problem with identifying yourself? I don't need to. You don't need to? No, it's my right to not. Oh, so you're looking to create problems is what you're doing? No, you're just accusing me of that. Absolutely, because you're refusing to identify yourself. That's not against the law. It's obstructing legal process if we have a reason to ask you. What's your reason? I've asked identify you. you. I... Obstructing legal process comes after you committed a crime. What do they not understand about that shit? I've just recently understood that concept. 
and I'm not even in law enforcement. But what is that's how ah! Boo! Boo! Let's continue. Just told you, no, no, but I asked you, you're recording our property. I have you're to identify myself. Doing, correct. And I have I to identify you myself identify yourself. if you have a reasonable, articulable suspicion. And what is that? You're looking to create problems is what you're doing. Is that what I'm doing? I, I By have, just filming and exercising my First Amendment right? That is my opinion, yes. Okay. Well, the good thing is the law doesn't go off your opinion. But it does when you're obstructing. Boom. Right there, bro. Right there. You got him. Cat got his tongue. Uh, 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 uh. Good to know that the law is not based on your opinion. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Mm -mm -mm. It's good though. This is a good cordial conversation. It's not too tense. For the most part, you know, they're. They're not getting, they're not like talking over each other, you know? It's, it's okay so far. Our requests. You can't, you you can request, right? But it's not a lawful order. It is a lawful order at this point. If you're, if. And as soon as my sergeant gets up sure. here, he's gonna tell you this. Okay. Okay? But you're not free to leave. You're correct. I'm not going anywhere. No, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, you know, I'm not like that. Right. Well, that's fine. So what's the problem with identifying yourself? I just so don't. You don't have to. I just don't need to. You don't need to. Yeah, I haven't broken any laws and you just said you nope, nobody said you broke any laws. I just said that your your activity is suspicious to us. Okay, and is that a misdemeanor our, or a felony? Listen, it's a concern for our safety and our welfare. And I'm not here to do any ill will, I told you that. We don't know that. I, I told you that. You could you could be who knows? Well, sure. Know. But I mean anyone going by here. Do you think but, I would be out in the open not all just in the activities. middle of daylight? You're not recording our activities. It's like the middle of the daylight. Are. I'm not hiding anything. I've literally hidden nothing. Believe me, people commit crimes in the middle of daylight too. Fair enough. Well, like I said, you're so not accusing me of anything. Which I get, and I appreciate you saying that. But that even more so just says I don't have to identify myself. It's my first amendment to film public officials doing what they do. Well, we'll, we'll see what the, uh, what the sergeant sure. has to say here when we get to it. Yeah, but I won't, I won't video you. No, you're good. Why do you get the sweet car? This gentleman's got a First Amendment right, he says, to videotape our activities around the police department and he's refusing to identify himself so that we know who we're dealing with. Okay, you don't want to identify yourself? Well, you? I don't need to. He said he doesn't suspect me of a crime or anything. And I'm okay, just, I'm just asking. No, but no, sir, I'm I don't. Just asking. Okay, we're good. Let's go. Okay. Right, have a nice day. My name's John, by the way. All right, John. Thanks, take care. <laughs> These men really don't know the law, dude. <laughs> you said that when my sergeant comes here, he'll say the same thing. All right, guys, we're good here. <laughs> What's that? Sergeant, what was your uh, name and badge number? Sergeant name and badge number 239. Thank you, sir. You have a good day. Here we go. Can I help you? No, I'm alright. Okay, this is private right here. Oh, I... Yep, you can go out on the street. Okay, but this is yep. not city property? What do you, can I help you or... No, is this city property? Yep. Okay, so, so it's public then. I'm in the back. So it's... <laughs> is this city property? Then it's public then, right? <laughs> Continue. Public, right? This is this is not you cannot be videotaping right here. You need to go over on the on a sidewalk. You're more than welcome on the sidewalk, but you can't be in here. This is all private right here. So who pays for this? This is our private. Who but who pays for this is what I'm So I'm just curious who pays for it. That's all. Because if if it's public then I could be on it, right? Okay, so it's... Okay, but this is private right here. Okay. Okay, so you 
cannot be on here. Okay. Well, I'll check with the city, but. Stand out on the street where you walk there. Sure. Sidewalk. What's your name and badge number? My badge number is 643. What's your last name? My last name is Weinsroom. Okay. What's your name and badge number, sir? Thank you. And so you're saying that, that, that this is not public? Okay. Okay. I'm not sure that that's correct, but I'll, I'll stand over here for right now, and then if it's not correct, we can address that later. Okay. Is there anything I can help you with? No, I've already answered that question. Okay. All right. On the sidewalk's perfectly fine. Okay. Okay. So right here is good? Yep. You're, you're perfectly fine there. What's your name and badge number, sir? Okay. I didn't see it until I'm coming down. Do you have a supervisor available? So in the event that was a trespassing, you would just get a warning, right? You would get a warning and then on a second time that they ask you or that you don't leave, at that point you can get charged. But you don't get a trespassing charge on the first warning, unless there was a sign that explicitly said authorized personnel only. At that point, you know, you can get charged on the first incident. Right here, okay. When you're done with him, sir, I'd like to chat with you. Okay. Well, I'm just curious. So I don't think that he's correct, number one, um, in the sense that if it's public and it is open to the public and easily accessible to the public, then he's not correct that I can't film or be in here. Well, it's what it is. Suspicious. It could be weird. Sure. hundred percent. So, I get that. If something suspicious like that is going on, we mm. want to stop and check out. And, sure. You know, this is totally respect that. unusual behavior, right? And I don't know about that, but I get it. Well, I mean, you're, I get that it could spark interest. You're, you're, you're filming a government in business mm -hmm. or a government facility and you're checking things out. That's sure. unusual. Let's zoom out here. Sorry. Yep. No problem. Um, um, but I do believe that Number one, those are city vehicles back over there, like the unmarked squad car that's back over there. So this is something that we all pay for, as that gentleman admitted. And so if that's the case, then I'm, I'm free to enter it, as long as it's not a, an access area that's blocked or restricted, which, like that, I, I can't go in and I can't I wouldn't go in there. In fact, you saw me standing right there. Now I can visit, I can visit, anything I can see visibly, I can take a video or a picture of. Correct, and anything that you can walk around. However, if you're going up to vehicles that don't belong to you and you're filming, that is suspicious. That is something we're gonna stop and check out. Totally and fine. Going on with. I completely understand. So if, I mean, if, if this is what you wanna to continue to do, I mean, have at it, but you're gonna get contact with police when you do this. And that, thing. that's okay, because you're, you're super respectful. I appreciate you clarif clarifying some things, but hopefully you can let that officer know that it's totally allowed to be over here, because it's not. See, why can't more, more officers be like that? Calm, cool, collected, and not trying to agitate and escalate situations. You know what I'm saying? But yo, check out some of my other videos in the description, pinned comment if you talk about with, with creating weed, or if you want to take more of a hold, stranglehold on your personal finance life, links in the description, the pinned comment, and in the cards for relevant information. But God bless, much love, peace, and joy, namaste, and always remember, if it doesn't feed you, don't water it, and too much of any good thing is good for nothing. Flip the script, I'm out. Deuces. No face, but the same story.